conservative New York Times columnist Brett Stevens on Wednesday poured cold water on the White House talking point that the origin of the now infamous Christopher Steele dossier alleging collusion between Donald Trump and Russia somehow invalidates the allegations made within the document. On Tuesday, the Washington Post reported that Fusion GPS, which funded the dossier, was originally commissioned by an unknown Republican operative, and later by Hillary Clinton's campaign and the DNC. Although it had previously been reported that Democrats bankrolled the opposition research, the Post report was the first linking the Steele dossier to the Clinton campaign. Mark E. Elias, a lawyer for the Clinton campaign and DNC, had fervently denied retaining Fusion GPS on behalf of the campaign. We have known for 25 years, since Bill Clinton told us, Kitty IDNT and Hale, that every statement out of the mouth of the Clintons is a calculation, Stevens said. The issue here ISNT who paid for opposition research. The question is is it true Stevens noted Fusion GPS, which is currently cooperating with Robert Mueller's investigation into Russian interference in the 2016 presidential election and possible collusion with the Trump campaign, is a serious organization. They fear that at least parts of this dossier contain truth, Stevens later added. Christopher Steele was a well-regarded British spy. The idea that it's all fake is classic Trump disassembly. Who paid for this is ultimately irrelevant, the Times columnist opined. Watch below, via MSNBC.